Good morning, everyone. Steve Georgie here from Allendale's Trading Floor. It is November 18th. Corn down penny and three quarters to start the morning. Beans up about a penny uh, with wheat down four and three quarters cents. So kind of following suit with what we had seen yesterday. Uh, harvest progress came out yesterday. Trade really isn't going to follow it too much um, at this point, mostly because we're 89% complete now for corn. Five-year average is 88 uh, 94% harvested uh, for beans, five-year average is 96%. So uh, we're right in line with that, and uh, you know, the trade's basically looking at it as it's it's pretty well wrapped up. Um, we did have some lighter volume overnight uh, as far as trade, uh, but the trade is now going to be focusing on option expiration now on Friday. So December options going off the board. Is it going to be as crazy as when the November went off the board with the beans, are we going to see some volatility ahead of that uh, as December contract, most hedging is done against the December for corn? Are we going to see corn now uh, have some volatility as we move toward that option expiration? So that is on Friday. Keep a focus on that. Uh, we'll talk about that more here as we get closer to that as well. Um, weekly export shipments. Um, or weekly export inspections, I should say, uh, were pretty good yesterday. Uh, looking at export shipments for October, it was a record that was released yesterday, 1% over uh, where we were at last year at this time. Uh, but as you go through and you look at what history suggests, that this is typically a peak uh, for the season here uh, on exports. So, yes, it was good, but what is coming ahead of this? We know we've got big crops out there for both corn and beans. How are we going to move through those? Can we keep this pace that we've seen for exports? We'll have to continue to see, but uh, this does suggest that this week typically is uh, the peak of the season here as far as exports, specifically for beans. So uh, we'll see if that does matter. We'll see if that matters to the price. But watch that overall here as we go uh, into Friday and the op option expiration for the December options. Um, looking at livestock. Box beef for cattle, very strong uh, last night. Choice up 211. Select up 174. No cash trades as of yet, but we did get cattle on feed estimates out. The trade's expecting 99.8% on feed, 92.2% marketed, and then expecting 94.8% placed. So as we get uh, closer to that uh, on feed number Friday, so those are those estimates that were released yesterday. Looking at hogs, we've had a quite an uptrend going. We did see cutout values down 34, though. Uh, cash market's still remaining firm and uh, could remain that way here for the next couple of weeks. But that trend pretty uh, pretty strong right now. We'll see if that can continue. As far as some of the outside markets, you got the stock market down five points. Gold's is up 14 bucks. Silver's up 17 cents, but we got the dollar setting back 41, so giving back some of the gains it had yesterday. But uh, give us a call if you guys have any questions. You can reach us here, 800-262-7538, or check us out on the web at allendale-inc.com. Hope you guys have a great day today. Stay warm. We'll talk to you again tomorrow. Take care.